Hi guys, uh, welcome to today's presentation. So my name is Mia, I'm from Mongolia. I'm an international student studying at the University of Debrecen. And today I'm going to introduce the agricultural programs to you guys. So let's first get into the about part. So the agricultural program, the education has more than 150 year old tradition in Debrecen. So it's one of the most traditional and the main uh, studies in the University of Debrecen. The programs are characterized by continuous development in education and research, and it puts a more emphasis on the practice-oriented education. So, and the practices are done on campus as well as with the industrial partners and other research institutes of the University of Debrecen. And the campus is more than 15 hectares large, and we should put the emphasis that uh, the agriculture program campus consists of more than uh, one camp faculty, it's actually two faculties, the Faculty of Agriculture and also the Faculty of Business and Economics. So next, um, for the perspective of international students for the University of Debrecen, here are some study programs offered in English. So um, here's the list for both the undergraduate programs and the graduate programs. And now I'm going to go over the list, so uh, let's get into more details of each programs. So first, let's take a look at the undergraduate programs. The first is the Agricultural Engineering Bachelor's Degree. So in the Agricultural Engineering undergraduate course, students learn about the different areas of agricultural sector, gain insight into crop production, animal husbandry, and also gain unique agro-technical knowledge. Example, the horticultural, fish farming, forestry, environmental, and game management knowledge. And students also acquire knowledge of science, technology, agriculture, and economics, which makes them agricultural professionals with general skills in agricultural production, processing, and farming. So the academic requir requirements to get into the agriculture engineering program is you're going you're gonna to need a high school certificate, interest examination in mathematics, and chemistry or biology. So it's going to be both written and oral exam. And the total duration would be uh, seven semesters and the tuition fee would be 6,500 US dollars per year. And next, let's take a look at the food engineering bachelor's degree. The program is aimed at training professionals who are able to operate, supervise and develop food processing technologies. And the studies include the physical, chemical and biological fundamentals of engineering with special emphasis on food quality and safety related issues. Besides becoming acquainted with operations and technological processes, the students also learn economic management and analytical subjects. The main goal of the program is to train experts who are able to fully provide services related to the everyday tasks of operation from engineering, biological and chemical work to management duties based on their comprehensive theoretical knowledge. And the academic requirements to get into this uh, in food engineering program is you're going to need the high school certificate, interest examination in mathematics, and chemistry or biology. And it's both written and oral exam. The total duration of this program would be six plus one semesters of the one semester. The last one is a 14 week professional practice. And the tuition fee is going to be 6,500 US dollars per year. And I actually have a few friends studying at the Food Engineering Bachelor's degree, and their class is not that big. It's a small group of uh, four, but now it's three people. So um, from, my, from what I heard of them, they get more into practice with their teachers, and their class is small, so they get to talk about more uh, in-demand topics with their teachers about their own countries. So the next program, the Precision Agricultural Engineering. It's a uh, program unique in Hungary and Europe. The training includes, in addition to the basic agricultural knowledge, the knowledge of precision agriculture, agricultural digitalization, the application and operation of precision agricultural equipment, info communication tools, the geoinformatics, data collection and data management, knowledge of the use of software in agriculture, knowledge of agricultural robotics, the basics of operating agricultural drones, knowledge of precision farming technology, the principles, structure, and operation of precision farming advisory systems. So for the academic requirements, you're going to need the high school certificate, the interest examination in mathematics, chemistry, or biology. It's a written and oral exam. 
the total duration would be uh, seven semesters and the tuition fee would be 6,500 US dollars per year. So finally, now uh, the Rural Development Engineering Bachelor's Program, it's actually in the Faculty of Business and Economics, but it's traditionally more connected to the agricultural uh, program. So it's also inclu included in our introduction to agricultural uh, programs. So I've been studying this program for the last two years. And um, for me, I would say that it's very interactive course, uh, both from the students and with the teachers. And it's also in the Faculty of Economics and Business. So in, in my part, I would say that I'm getting more knowledge about the business uh, and marketing, as well as the agriculture parts, for example, the horticulture, uh, production, plant production, and animal husbandry. So let's get into the slide. The purpose of the program is to train rural development agricultural engineers who can carry out organizational management administrative, log logistical, and production tasks related to production, service, and consultancy. With their acquired knowledge of agronomic, economic, management, business, analytical, advisory, agro-commerce, agro-marketing, environmental, and regional skills, and a deep understanding of the relationship between administrative tasks and the agricultural economy, they can carry out professional tasks that meet the market expectations. They have the competence to interpret rural development following according to the standards of the European Union with the necessary skills for planning and implementing rural development programs. And here's the academic requirements. You're going to need a high school certificate, interest examination in mathematics and chemistry, and it's a written and oral exam. So the duration would be, again, seven semesters. And the duration would be in seven semesters, and the tuition fee is a bit lower than the others. It's in total 6,000 US dollars per year. And now let's take a look at in the master's programs. So first, the food safety and quality engineering. It's the continuation of the food engineering bachelor's program built on chemical and food engineer basics. This program teaches the application of food analytical methods in practice in laboratories and processing plants while minding the product quality, food safety aspects like storage, handling, and transporting. The detailed raw material food qualification as well as quality assurance and quality management systems are also a big part of the program. So for the academic requirements, you're going to need bachelor's degree in one of the following is food engineering, chemical engineering, biological science, or agronomy. And the dur duration would be in total four semesters, and the tuition fee is 7,500 US dollars per year. So next is the agricultural environmental management engineering. In this study program, the emphasis is on all agricultural aspects of environmental management, such as the natural resource management, environmental impact assessment, environmental technologies, protection, and informatics. Also, the important parts of the programs are one, the technological and legal knowledge of environmental management, second, the impact of agronomy on the environment, and third, learning about the different kinds of agricultural te techniques like the precision agricultural tools, and fourth, the ecotoxicology. So as for the academic requirements, you're going to need bachelor's degree in environmental science, and the duration of this program is in four semesters, and the tuition fee would be 7,500 US dollars per year. So next is the agricultural water management engineering, uh, with the aim of the program is to train agricultural water management engineers who are able to use creative engineering in the field of sustainable integrated water management. This knowledge can be applied in crop production practice, knowing the specificities of agricultural water management and processes. The graduate students will know the applicability of the latest agricultural water management technologies and procedures and their legal regulations. The relationships between the economy, society, and the agricultural sectors will also be included in the study program. So for the academic requirements, you're going to need to have bachelor's degree in one of the followings. It could be environmental science, agricultural engineering, horticulture engineering, and so on. 
The duration of this program is again four semesters and the tuition fee is also 7,500 US dollars per year. And the next program, the Animal Husbandry Engineering. The field of animal science is very broad and the program reflects this diversity with emphasis on the physiology, nutrition, and genetics, gene conservation, functional food, and molecular bi biology, which are the key research areas of the Institute. Some other important areas of the program would be microbiology, domestic and wild animal health, mammal, poultry, aquaculture, fisheries, and management, food safety and quality, economics, and the planning of the animal farms. So uh, during my study here in the University of Debrecen, I come to contact with a lot of animal husbandry engineering master's students, and they've also told me about the research on the uh, animal farms, for example, their poultry. And for the academic requirements, the bachelor's degree in biological or animal science can be okay. Duration of this program is four semesters, Tuition fee would be 7,500 US dollars per year. And next would be the plant protection master's degree. The aim is to train specialists of plant protection who are able to fulfill managing, organizing, consulting, regulating, and marketing tasks based on their knowledge to prevent losses during crop production. The students will be able to identify the organisms which are threatening the healthy plants, for example, the pathogens, pests, and weeds. They will get acquainted with their biology and reproduction and will know the effects and mechanisms of pesticides and apply integrated viewpoints of alternatives of the chemical protection. So for the academic requirements, you're going to need undergraduate degree in the relevant field of science or the related area. And the duration would be four semesters. The tuition fee is again 7,500 US dollars per year. And for our next program, it's gonna be the crop production engineering. During the crop production engineering master program, the students learn the basic concepts of natural science, engineering, technology, food chain safety, and management that underpin plant production and become familiar with modern technologies used in crop production and their practical application. The training will focus on plant biotechnology, integrated crop production, integrated pest management, and the quality assurance in crop production and the sectoral economics of crop production. After the study, the graduates may find employment in the agriculture enterprises, in product development, in trade of agriculture goods. And the academic requir requirements would be the undergraduate degree in the relevant, relevant field of science or the related areas. The duration would be four semesters and the tuition fee is $7,500 US dollars per year. So the last but not least, the Rural Development Engineering Program. Um, we also have the master's program, so after I graduate the bachelor's, I can uh, enroll for the Rural Development Engineering master's program. The objective of the program is to train professionals who understand sustainable development and the present problems of rural areas based on knowledge relating to agriculture, economic management, as well as regional and rural development, who can cooperate in the determination of possible directions of development and can define special development programs, and also can manage their realizations and can carry out the monitoring of the processes. The wide range of management and rural development skills enable the graduates to pursue different careers and adapt their knowledge to different conditions in their home countries. The graduates may find employment at uh, maybe the agricultural companies or maybe in the public administration. The academic requirements would be bachelor's degree in rural development, agricultural economics, business, or management. And the duration would be four semesters, but the tuition fee is 7,000 US dollars per year. So as for the careers and further learning, um, let's look at, into the careers that the agriculture department can uh, offer to the students. The students after graduating can work related to the study program for an enterprise, for a government authority, or a consultancy agency, or any science-based sectors of the industry. And the master's students 
uh, will be able to design and develop in the engineering, research, and leadership fields. So as for the virtual learning, uh, the master's graduates can study in the doctoral schools at the University of Debrecen. We have the doctoral schools in the field of animal science, crop production and horticulture science, and also the nutrition and food sciences. So that's it for today. Thank you for your attention. And if you want further information about us, you can find uh, our official information on the e2.unidev.hu site. And if you also want to get in contact with us, you can email us at the info at edu.unidev.hu site. So that's it. And I hope to see you on campus soon. Goodbye.